Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, we are going to be looking at yet another player from the women's league, which is going to be the Liga F Tots Alba Redondo. I hope I didn't butcher a second name. I know it, the first name is Alba, but yeah, today we are going to be looking at this SBC, guys. You just have to do one squad build to get this player, and this is going to be a striker card now. To complete this SBC, you need to put a 85 rated squad in and you need to have a Spanish player while doing it. We will complete the squad midway through the video. But first off, let us look at the stats. Let us look at our positions, our playstyle pluses, uh, all those good stuff. Yeah, let's get started. Without any further ado, the first off, you guys can see her alternate positions and her preferred positions. So her main position is a striker. So she is a striker and the alternate positions are actually pretty decent left wing right wing so you can use her in any of the three forward positions which is left wing right wing and striker and you can use her at center forward so basically she covers literally the whole forward lineup you can use her at striker you can use her at false nine you can use her at left wing or right wing which is pretty cool you know i have never seen a player who's had uh, po alternate position as the rest of the three forward position but yeah this is a good card as as it stands as of now because for an 85 rated card you're getting a 91 rated uh, i mean for an 85 rated squad my bad you're going to be getting a 91 rated player a striker with decent pace good shooting good dribbling as well so these three stats shooting dribbling and pace are the three things that i look in for a striker because you need to have good pace you need to have good shooting and you need to have good dribbling when you're going at that speed and she has five star weak foot as well weak uh, skill move as you guys know i don't really care about it but yeah so far so good you know because she also has high attacking work rate obviously striker she has to have that and her acceleration type is explosive so that is also good preferred foot is the right which is really really nice uh, and looking at her pace, she has 93 acceleration and 93 sprint speed. We will be testing that out when we use her in the squad. We will make a squad around this player and we'll play squad battles with, in world class mode and you know test all these abilities, shooting, pace and dribbling. These three things we'll be testing mainly because she is a striker. And apart from that, if you look at the stats, she has 99 heading accuracy with 98 jumping. So if we are able to, you know, get a corner or two, maybe we will test out that as well. But apart from that, if you guys just have a glance at this card, the card looks really nice. She has 91 shooting with 90 shot power, 94 finishing, and she only has 89 long shots. But I don't think that's a big issue because she is going to be up there in front you know targeting the goal most of the time so i think 90 shot power with 94 finishing is really decent i would have actually uh you know enjoyed a little bit more volley on her 85 is a bit low i think but decent not bad she has 93 shot pass as well in her 82 rated passing stats if you guys look at that she has 92 shot pass which is also decent and she has very less curve she has only 75 curve i don't know how to feel about that because she also has finish shot play style it's not a play style plus but she just has the finish shot play style so i think that will cover up for her low curve rated so if you look at dribbling also she has pretty decent dribbling 92 dribbling 93 ball control and 92 agility i think that is not bad guys that is not bad so this is it for the stats now play style plus and play styles if you see she has only one at scoring which is the finish shot and in passing she has tiki taka plus and under ball control she has three and under physical she has three so under ball control she has technical plus she has first touch and press proven and under physical she has aerial because of her heading accuracy and then uh, jumping which is really insane and she has placed it also for that she has relentless which i how, how much is her she has only 84 stamina increases fatigue recovery during half time and extra time increases during du increases duration of teammate contain and partial team breath okay okay she has quick step as well so let us actually complete this and then test her out uh, build a squad around her and test her in game okay we have built a squad around her wait i'll show you guys the actual squad that i built so this is how the squad is looking and hopefully we can get 
a few goals with her and see how she is in game how her pace is how her shooting is how her dribbling is three main things that we are going to look out for in this um in this player review guys as is always the case the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game and actually the dribbling is really good guys oh oh the dribbling is really good pace is also really good guys uh she why is she on why is she on uh crosses why is mark is being suggested i mean mark quest please my controller is not working guys okay 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 good shooting let's go she has really good shooting guys i'm actually surprised how she has good she has good finishing but her shooting was what only 90 or something but she has really good shooting for a striker and her pace is really good guys her nice she's actually really good at shooting you know maybe this is because of the lower rated squad that i'm playing against but i am playing at world class guys oh she has really good uh, positioning as well I don't know what a positioning attacking positioning st uh, stats were but she has really good positioning as well. She gets behind the players really good and it's actually nice you know to get a good uh, she I would definitely suggest you guys complete the squad uh, SBC guys because I don't think it's that costly to get a 95 rated players in and somebody with five star weak foot who has good shooting stats who has good dribbling stats and is actually good on the field she has really good dribbling I, you guys can take my word on that she has really good dribbling and her pace is pretty good as well and if you work on a good chemistry style for her you guys saw the shot pass right it was really good if she would have had better defensive stats she would have won that stand tackle but it is fine not a big deal breaker but yeah coming to coming back to this spc definitely a good spc worth it i would suggest you guys complete this spc decent card decent uh, decent player as well i mean only the chemistry uh, part of the squad is going to be difficult to to pair her up with all the stuff but spanish player you should not be you should not have that much difficulty and uh, i think you can actually have, make a decent squad around her so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video Hope you guys enjoy this leave a like if you did and i'll see you in the next one until then take care stay safe they're motivated and keep smiling bye bye